And so did Gustav, apparently. He was terrified. Think 1969 Summer of Love gone ghostly evil. The malevolent don't wear flowers in their hair. No one survives. The ghostly. to the firehouse. I'm right behind you. In the meantime, find Ray. Oh, and don't forget, HQ is a no particle throwing zone. Good luck. It was definitely tax deductible last quarter. You can't invoke the act of God clause. It was a 25th century BC Harrapin leader of the undead. Don't tell me you were thinking of the Indus Valley civilization when you wrote that. No. Most certainly not. Consider discounts for federal employees gone if we can't fix that code. And no more tours around the firehouse for their children. Need I remind you of the time we encouraged the spirit of FDR to stop visiting the mayor during Nick's games? Ah, well, that's good news. I'll have Janine update the records. Bay Area Ghostbusters, you're here. Thank goodness. All hell's broken loose. Now, where did I put that? Ah, here it is. A brand new attachment for your neutrona throwers. We call it the heat beam. Where, where's Gabby? On my way, just uh, stuck in a blizzard. I've heard of Christmas in July, but blizzard in June? This is getting serious. You're going to need one of these. The heat beam is a new adaptation from Lars in our lab. It concentrates UV waveforms for targeted ice melting. Exactly what you're going to need in a time like this. It works like all other secondary functions, except you do need to prime it. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll be back when I find what I'm looking for. Would you help me look? It must be somewhere in the firehouse. It's a brass Swedish chocolate box about yay big. Your PKE meter will respond to it. Here, give it a go. Find something to melt. I'll keep looking back here. If you find the box, bring it to me. Use the heat beam to melt any ice that's in your way. here. Have you found anything yet?
Keep looking. Must be around somewhere. PKE meter should highlight the box if it's around you. Tell you the box is filled with chocolate. Will you look harder? You got it? Wonderful. Bring it back to me. There's a fast route if you're brave enough to give the pole a whirl. So you heard my message about Garaka's orb and the effect it's having on the ethereal residents of our town. The ghosts in our containment unit are really affected. This is the ancient orb that was brought to us containing his spirit. We've become adept at removing spirits from objects, but this one is tricky, quite tenacious. Forty years ago, a young college student brought this to us. He would have been a great guest for my show, Repossessed. Do you subscribe? Who am I kidding? Of course you do. The student claimed it had briefly contained the spirit of his dead sister and that he had pioneered the first technology in ghost trapping. Like so many who knocked on our door, he saw us as a way to get funding. And well, we saw a guy with an empty chocolate box. That student was Gustav Hookfaber. You all named Ghost Lord. A little on the nose, if you ask me. But look, we're trying to figure out how we can extract and contain Garaka's spirit to end this disruption. Maybe you can find something from Hook Faber's work that could help. Go back to San Francisco and head to the prison. Sorry I'm late. <laughs> I, uh, I think I, I think I caught all the, all the science stuff you said about the important things. Watch out! Another one leaked out of containment, duck! Use your heat beam to unfreeze Gabby. I'll go get my proton pack. <gasps> Whoa. So that's what life flashing before your eyes feels like. Oh. Okay, where were we? Uh, right. Got a spare pack around here? How can I help? When that ghost emerges again, use your heat beam to neutralize it. underneath it. Oh, good work, team. Golden years, indeed. Now, head back to the bay and give me a shout if you find out anything. How you doing there, Gabby? You need a shiny blanket? That and a stiff drink. Have you seen the weather here? I could ice skate to Alcatraz. It's so cold here, I saw a politician with his hands in his own pockets. Looks like Garaka's effects are wider spread than first thought. But the rest of the country seems fine. 
Something about this place must connect us to Garaka. Keep me in the loop. Before you go, what's with the new color scheme? The orange and green? It's not your new heat beam tech, is it? Light beam. The particle stream is routed through it. Could be picking up surface residue from the plasma sheet. Shouldn't affect the function. Team, you're looking for Gustav's diary, and I think your PKE meters will pick it up. Find it, and we figure out what he knew. Figuratively, fire. I'm gonna call you Shadow. 
chef? Cause you're about to cook. PKE readings are spiking. You 58 days on this lifeless island, and the breakthroughs keep coming. The surge of suffering in the air is palpable, and tortured souls I further torment. destroy itself if you don't pick it up soon. As soon as you can, pick the diary back up before it blows. Oh, well done. It's under control again for now. Damn. It looks hella cold there.
didn't think Gustav's diary would be this hard to retrieve. Do whatever it takes to get it out. Have you seen the weather here? I could ice skate to Alcatraz. It's so cold here I saw a politician with his hands in his own pockets. Looks like Garaka's effects are wider spread than first thought. But the rest of the country seems fine. Something about this place must connect us to Garaka. Keep me in the loop. Before you go, what's with the new color scheme? The orange and green? It's not your new heat beam tech, is it? Might be. The particle stream is routed through it. Could be picking up surface residue from the plasma sheath. Shouldn't affect the function. Team, you're looking for Gustav's diary, and I think your PKE meters will pick it up. Find it, and we figure out what he knew. You 58 days on this lifeless island, and the breakthroughs keep coming. The surge of suffering in the air is palpable, and tortured souls I further torment. You got it. Now, get it out of here. Whatever you're seeing there, I'm not getting it. The diary is affecting those objects. Find another way out. Damn. It looks hella cool. Looks like the diary will destroy itself if you don't pick it up soon. I'm gonna call you Chef, because you're about to cook. Oh, well done. It's under control again for now. Soon as you can, pick the diary back up before it blows. like no other, the darkest of dark energies. It is a power I can drain and drain again. A timeless existence.
it takes to get it out. once it gets back to me. Let's find out what Gustav knew. The ice even got in here. Let's focus, team. The diary revealed Gustav was trapping ghosts in everyday objects and then left them in his factory. Find some of those objects and bring them to the frequency generators. Heat it up!
Okay. Scan the slime to get the location of a special object that's resonating at the same frequency. Bring it back here and place it on the frequency generator. Now, get it to the frequency generator. Place the object on the frequency generator. Let's see what comes out. Well done. Now, turn the crank handle to lock the object in place. Perfect. Lastly, you gotta pull the lever to fire a resonant pulse down into the portal. on the frequency generators to locate the matching objects. <laughs>
Another one. Awesome. These things are really just everyday, unremarkable things. Don't forget to use the crank handle to lock the object onto the frequency generator. Remember, you need to pull the lever to fire a pulse into the portal. Unexpected. 
A desynchronization between material and etheric planes, perhaps. We've seen Garaka's effects on space and time here. <clears throat> Whatever you call it, ghosts that were like dead dead are now not. Get me some physical evidence. That will help us get to the bottom of things. <laughs> you can't win! mission what the hell's going on i've been analyzing your body plan footage from gustav's mansion bitsy and i have uh it's my theory yet you're just catching up get this gustav was researching the march of the malevolent it's an ancient prophecy about the coming of a ghost lord destined to usher in every restless soul seeking revenge on the living big t's done whole shows about it can you tell because i knew it was imminent and so did Gustav, apparently. He was terrified. Think, 1969 Summer of Love? That was ghostly evil. The malevolent don't wear flowers in their hair? No one survives. The ghost lord's here to rule the first ever city of the dead. San Francisco! So, we think Gustav got obsessed with the ghost lord and his experiments may have conjured up the very thing he was afraid of. I'm on my way over to you now. You need all the... I'm sorry, I gotta get this. <laughs> 